So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today guys I'm going to showcase to you how you can get this amazing new whip of not long found. This heavy attack kind of like doubles up into like a sword kind of thing. Wild. How's it going guys? My name is DPG and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So first off, I won't lie to you, whips ain't my kind of thing, I've got a few but I, I'm going to be the last person to build around them. I know there's benefits to them, especially in PvP, but hey, they're just not my kind of thing whatsoever. But this one seemed quite unique, so I thought, you know what? Might as well drop a video on it. It may, may work for somebody out there. Okay, so the whip is called the Yumi. It scales with that strength and dexterity. It requires 10 in strength and 19 in that dexterity. So yes, you can also apply a natural ward to this thing. So hey, if whips are your kind of thing guys, this is where you come to get it. So we are basically at Carrier Manor, as you can see, right here on the map. So east side of the map, I mean sorry, east, east, what am I talking about? West side of the map, west side of the map people. And you can see, it's actually where Loretta, you first meet Loretta here. But you don't have to go that far, you ain't got to worry about that. But if you guys haven't got this uh, unlocked, I will lead you to the actual place where this whip is obtained from, the very, very entrance of it. So hey, make your way up here, guys, and we can come up this hand side here. Let's do that. Just do what you gotta do, people. Get here. Get here. Okay, so from the main entrance, this is where you gotta go. So we have to make our way to the uh, first grace, which is around this area here. And if, you've, if it's your first time here, guys, you wanna be careful. Got these big old dirty hands with those dirty fingernails jump up at the floor and try and touch you up. Yep. So yep, you can see one there. Forget that. So let's follow the path I'm taking, guys. Another one there. And you want to come up these stairs on your left hand side. Run past all the enemies, don't worry about them. Just run straight into this door. And there we go. Now up here there is a grace. So you obviously want to activate this grace if you haven't already. Just in case you die. You shouldn't die, but hey, you never know. Okay, so then you want to come across here. Enemies will spawn in. Run straight past them. Don't stress over them. Completely ignore them. I'm going to run around here, guys. And keep going straight, just like so. Just like a soul. Now we're going to go to the end and then turn left on ourselves. Again, ignoring all these enemies. And you hear, see here, guys, where the bricks have like, broken off? You want to jump down there, so just run and jump. Simple as that. You should be fine. Oh, I didn't see you there. I'll pick you up while I'm here. You know? Okay, so this is where you need to go. So once you jump down, you want to come right. And then right here, guys, you have a few hands. Take these out. One there hanging off the wall. Take him out too. And then, guys... It is literally located on this body right here. And that's how you get this Yurimi uh, whip, guys. And it is as simple as that. If you guys enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more out on Ring, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, people, I will see you on that next one.